Alright, what's going on guys? Here I'm again doing another Black Ops 2 Zombies video. This time I've got some leaked information for you guys, and I know this is probably a little bit late, but I just thought I'd make a video of it anyways. So these are some of the achievements that have been leaked. Um, it was on the Call of Duty f community page, and it was only up for about a day, and then Activision took it down, either because they were way, way off, or they were way way correct and I think that in my opinion they sound about right because let's say let's go down to number 50 which there's 50 achievements in Black Ops 2 so far that have been leaked and I'm only covering the zombies ones in this video but Number 50 is called Happy Hour and Transit by two different perks before turning on the power. So that sounds about right, and I'll explain that in a little bit. But for the first achievement, it's I don't think they exist. In Transit, kill a screecher for 10 gamer points. And Transit sounds like maybe the map that might come with the game, it probably is. Because why else would they have achievements? for a map that hasn't even come out yet. So I'm pretty sure that this will be the map that is coming with the game. And then they also mentioned in the reveal trailer back in like May that they're working on a map and they called it the map, which that was what they called the, the name of the map was. And I don't know, maybe there will be two of these, maybe there will be Transit and The Map, or maybe The Map is Transit, maybe it's the exact same map, I don't know. And so, wh where was the Screecher first introduced? It was actually in Black Ops 1. It was introduced in Shangri-La. So, I don't find it too surprising that this zombie is coming back, and so far, this sounds about right. So, yeah. Um, next one, we have You Have No Power Over Me. In transit, defeat the Avogado God Row, sorry, without being attacked by it. I don't know, maybe it's like George or something. Um, I don't know, maybe this Nate, the title of this achievement can give us some hints. You Have No Power Over Me. I don't know. What do you guys think about this? Maybe it's like I said just a little bit ago. Maybe it's like George or maybe you're actually fighting a giant avocado. <laughs> no, but I don't know. What do you guys think about this achievement? I This one, if there's any of them to be fake, I think it's number 42. So next one, standard equipment may vary. In transit, acquire four different equipable items in one game. So, I don't know what it means by this. Maybe it's like bouncing beddies or something. Equipable items, like body armor. I don't know. Uh, once again, tell me what you guys think about this one. And the next one, dance on my grave. In transit, acquire your tombstone. I, I don't really know what to think of this one. So, once again, put your suggestions or any of your ideas about any of these in the comments below. I'm probably just going to keep saying that for every one of these, but next, Undead Man's Party Bus. In transit, complete all the additions to the bus in one game. And I'll come back to this one in a little bit. So next, we have the Light of Their Eyes. In transit, pacify at least 10 zombies with one EMP. So, I don't know, maybe an EMP is like a drop on the ground, like a nuke or something. Uh, maybe it's like an EMP grenade. That's what I think it probably would be. And so you have to, you know, get 10 zombies with an EMP. Like, you have to have 10 zombies behind you, throw a EMP grenade behind you, and then it'll pacify them. So next, we have Don't Fire Until You See. In transit, have all doors opened without being set on fire. I I don't know what it means by this really. Have all the doors open without being set on fire? Maybe like it sets you on fire if you get close to like a door or something. I don't know. The next one, green run side quest. 
complete the green one run side quest and that's 75 gamer points so this one I think that's a probably gonna be an Easter egg because most likely since all these others I mean the the largest one up till now was 47 that was 25 gamer points and this one is 75 I think green run side quest that is probably gonna be the Easter egg in this so it might just be called green run I don't know so next we have fuel efficient in transit use an alternate mode of transportation so in transit you probably have trains so you could probably use one of those to get around but I don't know so like if we go back to undead man's party bus in transit complete all the additions to the bus in one game I don't know maybe you could go around in a bus and I don't know maybe you have to get undead man's party bus before you can actually like take the bus and use it I don't know so next and the very last leaked achievement I have for you guys today is called happy hour in transit by two different perks before turning on the power so as we all know in multiplayer you can't buy any perks without turning on the power but on solo you can buy one and that is quick revive so i don't know if this is if this is suggesting suggesting sorry that you have to get this achievement on solo and you can't get it on multiplayer i'm not sure but since one of them is probably quick revive well what's the other perk i don't know maybe i don't know just what do you guys think about this what other perk do you think there'll be that you don't have to turn on the power to get? Because most of them you would have to turn on the power, like Juggernaug. That I, I seriously 100% doubt that you're gonna be able to buy that without turning on the power. So, yeah, that's about it for my zombies achievement le list, and I'll see you guys in the next Black Ops 2 video. Peace.